So, for a long time, I had been planning with a few of my really good friends a multi-day camping fishing trip in search of, really, a good time. But more specifically than that, in search of big trout and striper. Fortunately for me, I live right beside a few world-class rivers that have exactly what we're looking for. We got Evan and Dees just bomb squatted the Enterprise Rapids and took a little bit <laughs> took a little bit of water. Her first day went well a little unexpected. We flipped the canoe and didn't catch as many fish as we really expected to. But we didn't let that get our hopes down. We got settled in for our first evening on the water, set up camp, got some good food cooking, and we're brainstorming about the following morning. Oh my gosh, on a dry. Blake hooked up on, all right, you've got it, your chance here, Blake. Keep him up in the, keep him up in the top water column if you can. There you go. Keep that heat on him. Right, up. Broad angle up towards Paul. There you go. Head first. Scoop. Oh my gosh, man. Let me see that thing, Blake. Oh my. I have and I can really say it. Let me see it. Hold that thing up, Blake. Close. So we had found the trout we were looking for on the dry fly. Epic. We still had a mission, and that was to find one of these big, giant strippers. We knew where they were, and we knew exactly what they were eating. It was really just a matter of being there at the right time, the right place. Giant, but dang, it's a good one. It's, it's well worth it. <laughs> yes. Woo! All right, let's send him off. Easy, easy. Keep the heat on him. There you go. Right up. Keep the heat on him. Yep, 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 yep. He's in there. Yes. <laughs> Woo -hoo. Yeah, diesel fist bump, bud. Hug yeah. yeah. The stoke was high after those strippers. We had pretty much got what we had come for, and more. But the only thing was is we were running out of water. <laughs> and what I mean is we had floated the whole river entirely by the time we got those strippers. So we had made it from the dam all the way to the lake. So we had the thought of, okay, let's pack up, let's get the raft out, and let's head to some small streams. We fished the big water, We've caught the big trout, the big striper. Let's go target some small streams. So that's exactly what we did. Yep, got him. Yep. On cam. He's not very big, but he ate the hopper. It's always fun. All right, see if we can get him in here. Come on, bud, get over here. It's not very big, but he ate that hopper like, I mean, he meant business. So that was really cool. All right, said he's not very big, but uh, it's always nice to catch a fish on a fly you tied yourself. And that indeed was caught on a fly I tied myself. Awesome. Boom. Got that big ugly hopper. Let's get it out. Yeah. Let's let him go. 
See you, bud. All right, guys, I didn't get all that on film, but he's a good, decent fish. He's not huge. The way he took it, though, you would have thought he was massive. Okay. There it is. Jig streamer in the mouth. That time he got the back hook on that thing. Nice. For a split second, I thought he was a monster. See you later, bud. All right, let's keep fishing.